Now, I want to get busy on the first couple of subjects for today. Everybody that's okay, say, I'm okay. Here's the first subject that I've, I found so interesting, I want to share it with you. Then I want to talk about personal development, the subject that I started listening to age 25 that revolutionized my whole life, from my mentor, Mr. Earl Schof. Here's an interesting subject. Just jot it down. It's called Enlightened Self-Interest. Enlightened Self-Interest. It's a fascinating study to study the idea of self-interest. But just make this note. All of us, you know, have self-interest. The key is it for it to be enlightened so that everybody wins and no one loses. Our first interest is to survive. What does it take to survive? Our second interest is to succeed. What does it take to succeed? What does it take for me personally to survive and to succeed? Can I legitimately be interested enough in the things that help me both succeed and survive? And here's what I discovered. The answer is yes. It's possible to exercise self-interest, but to do it in such a way that no one loses, everyone benefits. Key phrase, life was not designed to give us what we need. Life was designed to give us what we deserve. We do not reap a harvest in the fall because we need it. We reap a harvest in the fall because we deserve it. Not necessarily from a moral standpoint. Of course, there are some moral laws as well, spiritual and moral laws. But just the basic laws that simply say, if you wish to reap, you must plant. So jot this down. Reaping is reserved for the planters. And the reason they reap is because they deserve it. They're the planters. They deserve to reap. Interesting Bible phrase that says, if, if you keep knocking, you'll find open doors. Good phrase to jot down. If you keep knocking, you'll find open doors. Doors of opportunity. Doors of a chance to meet someone. Doors open for association. Doors open to find someone special. Doors open to find a, a unique business colleague. If you keep knocking, the door... The phrase says, doors of opportunity are open to those who continually knock. So we don't find open doors of opportunity because we need them. We find them because we deserve them. Only those who knock deserve to find an open door. But the promise is, if you continually knock, you'll find doors of opportunity.